What is up, YouTube? This is James Dubset of Bonto coming back with you another fan pack mail day. This is Texas Rangers. They paid ten dollars and sixty-five cents to send. They were really kind. Uh, I got a call from them too, saying uh, if like there was a game or something, why would you like to go to? Uh, to see Arlington in Arlington, Texas. I said I go with my friends sometimes and I uh, try to get autographs from both teams. Uh, they said they're making another, uh, they're going to be making another uh, baseball field. So they're, that baseball field's uh, going to get be ready in, to play in 2020. So this is a fan pack from the Texas Rangers. They paid a nicely $10.65 to send me. They gave me a 2018 yearbook. Boom. So, this one is gonna. So, uh. So, this was Arlington Stadium in 19. 72 to 1993. This is their uh, Global Life Park in Arlington 1994 through 2019. And then this one is going to be coming in 2020 Global Life Field. That's going to be the field. And it's going to be a dome. So that's cool. I was talking to the guy. I forgot his name. He actually gave me a call. And... I got, I think, five or four stickers. Five stickers. Texas Rangers stickers right there. Two, three, four, five Texas Rangers stickers. I'm probably going to do. t-shirt wax and I got a nice Texas Rangers snapback hat Texas Rangers right there this is sponsored by Carter blood care right there that's cool and they sent me a nice t-shirt Texas Rangers t-shirt right there this and the hat might be promotional giveaways Let's see the t-shirt. <clears throat> it's an extra large. Oh wow. It's an extra large in kids. So if you're if you're a Texas Rangers fan or if your son or daughter is a extra large in this size, I will ship it out to you. Or if you want all this Texas Rangers gear, I can ship that out to you too. So the Texas Rangers, it was a nice fan pack. Thank you, Texas Rangers, for this nice, lovely fan pack. I appreciate it. And I can't wait to try to go to your stadium and see if I could get any, collect any baseball or collect any autographs. Thank you guys. Have a nice night. I might do a couple, another video. I'm going to Yankees game versus Red Sox tomorrow. Uh, so I'm getting ready to get some. Uh, I'm getting some photos ready. Some photos and some cards ready to get signed at the game. I might be printing some out at uh, CVS. I might be doing the Boston Red Sox too. I don't. I'm not sure yet. Uh, it would be cool if I got a autograph of a baseball that I caught, but I'm probably not going to do that because, eh, I could try it. But uh, thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, comment.
I hope you guys enjoy this video whenever you guys are watching, uh, watching this at nighttime or morning, or if you're in bed, you could watch it. Uh, I just, I just like the our community right now. It's growing with kids, little kids, and sometimes there, there's a channel called the Life of EG, I think, and it's a father and a son. That's that's some of the some of the videos are some of the YouTubers are like in our community are like a family or sometimes just one person I kind of like our I love my community uh, I'm probably gonna do a softball tournament I'm not sure yet or a baseball tournament next year probably so if you guys are down to uh just hang out in white plains or like one it would be a summer day or something like that we could probably go to my uh public park baseball park we could play up there for a little bit we could talk uh or if you guys want to go ball hawking with me at yankee stadium I'm trying to go to ball hockey tomorrow. I'm trying to catch a ball or a couple of baseballs. Uh, I'm not sure where I'm going to sit yet, but uh, probably going to hang out with Zach Hampel. So, if Zach Hampel, if you're watching, uh, I really want to uh, hang out with you at the Yankee game. I know that I'm supposed to do a uh, watch with Zach Campbell game but sometimes I'm there and I see you and one time or two times I've been in your videos and I love that I love that how like you're really nice with kids uh, sometimes like I feel like there could be sometimes better with everybody at games uh, I just can't wait and until tomorrow, I'm a huge Yankees fan. I'm probably going to wear an Aaron Judge jersey. No, no, no. I'm going to wear a Stanton jersey. I'm going to try to get Aaron Judge on my Aaron Judge jersey. Signed in Silver Sharpie. Uh, I haven't... I haven't had any luck with Aaron Judge yet. Because he hasn't been there because he's been injured. But I'm probably going to ask him to sign on his part. I know I have another 8 by 10 of Aaron Judge. It's going to be right here. Comment below if I should, where I, where should I try to get Aaron Judge on this 8 by 10 and what kind of color, sh colored Sharpie I would try to get. This is an amazing photo, I would say. I bought it really cheap. It was like $4.99 with a baseball hologram on it. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, comment. Probably gonna get some uh, Red, Sox, Red Sox players photos from CVS tomorrow I'm not sure yet just got to think about it uh it would be cool for the painting that I have up there to see if he could sign that too I'm not sure if he can because it it has the artist autograph on it already but uh I could still try to get that signed by him uh I was going to try to get DD to sign a couple stuff. So, I was thinking DD to sign this in silver Sharpie. This photo, it's a cartoon photo. I thought it was going to be like a, just a regular photo, but it's a, it's a uh, cartoon photo. But you never know, he might sign it, he might not. So I just can't wait for this year, for next year's uh, Yankees baseball. Uh, October 13th, Andy Pettit is coming to my church. 
Andy Pettit or Tiger Yankee pitcher, player two. Saturday, October 13th at 6 p.m. to welcome Aunt retired Yankee Andy Pettit. He will be sharing about his life, faith, and career as a Yankee pitcher. The address is 465 Ridgeway, White Plains, New York, 10601. So I hope you guys come. If you're from local, if you're local, that would be cool. He might sign autographs. We got a nice 8x10 from eBay with a MLB hologram on it. Andy Pettit. It's so funny. This was actually the photo that they used when I was in middle school. And I don't know where that photo is. I got that photo and I have a Lance Berkman autograph too. But I don't know where those are. Uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? So I just can't wait for tomorrow. Uh, and I can't wait for October 13th. Uh, it's going to be fun. Tomorrow's going to be fun. Tomorrow's going to be great, I would say. Uh, I would get my bus. No, no, no. I'll finish work at 3. Well, I'll start work at 9 a.m., finish at 3, Get go get a bike in White Plains, and then drive down, ride my bike, ride the line bike to White Plains train station, then park the bike over there, then get the train to Yankee Stadium. I'll probably do a vlog tomorrow, I'm not sure yet. Uh... But I'm I'm excited, man. I'm excited that it's fun, that it's cool, that there's a lot of people in our community that's doing uh, baseball autographs, uh, TTMs, uh, packages, care packages, buying baseball cards. Crazy. I haven't opened these uh, baseball cards yet. Donner's Baseball, Puzzles and Cards, 1990. I have not opened 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 yet. I'm probably not going to do that because it's smart it's smart not to do that, I would say. Because uh, Jab's family, he says not to open them, I think. To just save them, uh, just like that, because sometimes... Some of those cards are actually worth a couple million, or, or like not even. They're probably cup. They're probably worth a lot of money because they're, they're 1990. That's a full set of Donner's baseball 1990 cards. So, thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, comment. Sorry it was too long, of a video, but. God bless you guys. Peace out. Peace out. God bless you.